flower. How do I make one? Can I make one? Oh, yeah, actually, I can, but I have to have this weird shenanigans going on. So no more, no making flowers for me, I guess. Okay, we're at five and four, so not too much further to go. Thank goodness. All right, so we've got these stacks and stacks of stone. I say we go ahead and make a place to spawn monsters. Not a whole lot. Just, you know, a, a nice place to spawn a few of them could be useful. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to tear all this up. And then we're just going to make a pathway into darkness. And then tonight, instead of... Well, I mean, I'll, I will take a nap. But then I will also not stay asleep all night. There we go. Okay, good. Oh, these are full blocks. I didn't even notice that. We'll replace... Or we'll start with pretty blocks. And then we've got this guy here. So we'll just head off in this general direction. And until we're far enough away from the light, the monsters should start spawning. Let's see. I guess we'll go ahead and use our cheaty cheaty F7 again. Yeah, so at night, monsters have a potential to spawn here. We need to block it off, though, so they can't get out without my say-so. And we can do that just using some more cobblestone slabs. And I, this is not the perfect plan. And I never claimed that it was. I just said this is going to be... I said, I said to myself, not to you folks specifically, just to myself, because I often find myself talking to myself when I'm making these videos by myself. I says to myself, you know what, self? And myself said, what's that, self? And myself said, we need some monsters. And myself said, why? And myself said, well, we're going to have to get some monster bits eventually. String would be nice. Bone, will, mo bone mill would be nice. And myself says to myself, yeah, you know what, you're right. And then myself says, I know that I'm right. And then myself says... You should do that in this video. And myself says, I agree. And myself says, yeah, it's going to be great for YouTube. The ratings are going to be off the chart. TV guide, the green letter guide. What is it? The green, the green, green guide? Just green guide. Yeah. Green guide letters is a podcast uh, about the letters sent to the green guide. And hopefully we'll be in there. Someone will be talking about us because of course, I don't know if y'all knew this, but my YouTube videos are broadcast on Australian television. Not really. Not, not at all. In fact, that's not a thing that happens. Ooh, lightning in real life. Hope the power doesn't... Boy, that would be the worst time for the power to go out. Right now, in the middle of this... This nightmare. You folks would miss out on all the fun. That would be terrible. You know what? Thinking about it, we could probably take things a step further if we wanted to. Cover that bit, and then monsters would spawn even during the day. Ooh. Ooh, it's worth a shot. Let's do it. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're going to... Do I have any more? I do. Okay. Just, uh, here? Okay, and then they don't need to be that tall, really. I mean, just tall enough for an Enderman to fit under, and that's like three tall. So, we're set there. We're more than set there. Oh, this is going to be good. This is going to be fantastic. We're going to have all kinds of monsters over here. I think they have to be a certain distance away from the player, though, don't they? Like, you can't be right on top of them or they won't start spawning, which could be an issue. But hopefully, hopefully it won't be. All right, we'll fill all this in. Oh, no, that's not... Oh, hey, you know what I just realized? Watch me. There we go. Oh yeah, son. And we need to... I, I don't know why I made this decision, but for some reason I took the outside edges. It doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be a perfect match, but on the other side, these outside edges are, have blocks on them. There we go. I just felt it was important for consistency. Also important for consistency that I poke a hole out right here. Go ahead and take this block out. And then we might as well poke the hole out here as well. And then just kind of lean over the edge delicately and click. Perfect. All right. And now if we, uh, some people won't like the fact that these are elevated and floating. I do. It adds a little something, something. If we take a look in here, we should now have monsters only spawning at night because of course there's still too much light getting in. Darn it. What if we fill these sides in though? Like that's going to make a pretty big difference. Yeah. Look how dark it is in here. Come on. Monsters are all about the darkness. Tell me some monsters. Oh my gosh. Um... Okay, I think we're good. I hit the wrong button there. No, monsters still don't want to spawn in here. It's probably still too bright for them. And I don't agree with that, like, sentiment. I think that they should just get over their issues. But at the same time, I think the sun is setting. He said, hopefully. Not even close. Let's go check on the bees. Because it's been a while since I was over here making sure they're doing their bee thing. Neither of them has done anything of, of note. So, whatever. Maybe we still on this side of the monster paddock? Now, huh? Huh? No, no, still not. Okay, well, what's a guy got to do to get some monsters around here? This is, shouldn't be that difficult. Okay, look at this. For the folks who didn't like it that this was so uh, so sparse, we're going to fill in these sides. Not for you, mind you. This is for me. 
Oh, darn it. We're all out. Gotta go get some more, though. Gotta finish this before the sun sets and monsters do spawn in there. Dog and cat are at it again. We've been going that long. We've been going long enough for them to stop going at it and then start going at it again. Fantastic. Where's my... Where, where, where is it? There it is. Alright, well, if that hasn't done it, the only other alternative... Is to go down here and place blocks, which I can't do, because how am I supposed to get up there? What I can do now, though, if I kind of want to keep them at bay, is create some, or just take some half slabs, put them here, and then now they can't get to me. <laughs> so when they do spawn, I can just take their legs out, and then go in and collect the goods. And I guess I could get down there if I really wanted to using our underground layer that we built, and I probably should. Look at this. More of these guys. Hey, a bit more honeycomb. We're that much closer. Get after it, bees. Keep keep it going. Need our queens. This one's already got a queen. Got a new queen. Cool. All right, so this kind of makes me a little bit nauseous, but here we go. All right, there, 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 there. All right, we need to get over there, though. So let's just uh, keep it going. Perfect. Good work. Oh, I guess monsters are about to start spawning, though, because it's, it's getting dark. You get that way. Come on now. There we go. Okay. This way now. Ugh. This is some nerve-wracking stuff right here. I don't like it at all. It makes me very nervous. And I don't I don't want to be doing it, but someone's gotta do it. Am I right? I am right. I know I'm right. You don't have to tell me. Could I? I mean, is there enough space up here for me to put one of these here? How do I do this? How do I I can't. What if I did it here? That's too high. Oh, all right. So I'm gonna go hand stand over here and see if monsters spawn over there. I know I should go to bed because that's when these guys are gonna get active because they're not active at all. But I really want monsters to spawn. Come on, guys. Oh, they're they're spawning on the roof. Um, I didn't anticipate that. There's also something inside there, but that doesn't look like a skeleton. That's not at all something we want in here, whatever it is, right? That's the way you do it right there. And then we can just hop up there and collect their dead bits. Or they'll come down here to us, and then we'll collect their dead bits, whichever works for them. I should probably eat something, because I don't want to be on low health when they come over here looking for a fight. Hey, get out of my wheat, darn you. What are you doing? Good, we got the bone. That's what we wanted. That's what we wanted this whole time. We just want to test this theory to see what happens. How are you alive? What kind of foul demon magic are you using to stay alive? Okay, so we've got some bones. Got some bone meal. What happens if we bone meal just dirt? That's the question we're asking here today. Nothing. Nothing happens. It's useless. Useless experiment. Didn't even need to... What a waste of time. Lots of cool stuff you can do with bone meal. None of it's uh, particularly useful right now, though. Sadly. Well, we need to fix that roof issue. That's kind of a new priority. Maybe we should make a ladder. Nah, we don't need a ladder up there, because we're not going to go back up there for any reason. What else do we have? A creeper and whatever that thing is. I don't want to know what that thing is, actually. Ooh. Okay. Well, it's talking to us. That's not pleasant. So maybe put one here, and then the other one there. Perfect. Uh, should we go in there and face it? It's breathing deeply, too. It's, like, breathing very heavily. Uh. What's up, guys? Come here. What's up, guys? Hey! No, 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 you stay in there. You guys, you guys are funny, but seriously now, y'all. Y'all stick behind bars. Okay, whatever you are. You don't look like something I want to engage in, like, fair, a, fair, a fair fight does not... Yeah, that doesn't look like it's going to serve me well. Oh, gosh. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, he makes you drunk on contact. That's never a good... That's never a good sign. Come and get me, mate. Come and get me. Right this way. Slow and steady. Wins the race. That's... That's good on you, Blitz. Have I killed it? I haven't killed it yet. All right, let's just Blitz it. Awesome. We killed the Blitz. And he dropped some... Some some nitor from Thermal Foundation. Don't know what that is. Don't know what that does. Don't know if I care. What I do care about is the fact that at least now we have bone mill. And even though it's useless, 
Maybe we'll find a use for it? How do I make grass? Is there... There's no there's no recipe for grass. There's a recipe for dirt. If y'all want some podzel. What do you what do you do with podzel? I don't even know what that's used for. I can't get any because I can't get leaves. Because I don't have a way to get leaves. Because we have issues. Darn it. Hey, Oompa! One step closer. Hey, here's an idea. Well, there's that idea wasted. I was going to keep building downward, but then I realized... How? Do bees, they've been asking. That's what they've been demanding. Do the bees. They'll be fun, they say. Where's the fun at, guys? I'm not having fun. Oh, well, I mean, I guess I am kind of having fun. This is a little bit fun. Not with the bees, though. It's just basic crafting. There's not even there's not even mining in this. It's just all crafting. There's barely any crafting. They just give me stuff. So we go out one. Right, and then we can do this. How far down is that going to go? Good. Good. Keep doing that. Ha ha! Perfect. Oh, we're all out. No, wait. No, we're not. Hold on. What? Do, 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 do. Boom. Do, 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 do. Boom. Do, 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 do. Oh, I should just wait for these, I guess, because they're about to be done. Sure would be nice if I had a bee Eliza right now, because then I could find out, taking it from a bee, flowers, flower. Yeah, I don't even know what to do with a gene sample, or blank gene samples, or genetic tools, because I wasn't paying attention throughout the last mission. If I had a bee Eliza, though, boy, howdy, would I use that thing to find out more about these bees, and then, like, genetically splice them to make sure they were the most efficient they could be. So I'd love some efficient bees right now. All right, you can start doing your thing again. I don't know why I'm carrying these around with me. What are you doing now? Okay, I, are we in the like the best using these meadow drones? I guess we are. They seem to be producing things. Well, this one, they both took off there for a second and then immediately stopped whatever it was they were doing. Okay, so I can now edit down here manually. If I need to. That's good. Yes! Alright, we're good here. You're good. You're done. Do we have any more like water ones? Any more damp... Or anything else that might want to go? No, of course we don't. All right, never mind then. I was going to say, we got some water drones. Should I go ahead and just keep producing? I guess we'll put the queen back in there. Because we're going to need meadow queen. Yeah, what's this one? Meadow princess? I could create another meadow queen, but I don't know what the big advantage would be to that. All right, fine. You get back in there and keep doing that. Let's see if we can get some monsters to spawn, and then we'll go to bed. Well, yeah, we'll see if we can get some to spawn. You don't want some bone meal well flowers? You don't want some bone meal? Alright, looks like there's some spiders and stuff spawned in there. Okay, bright new morning. You guys should be going again. Full bore, you're the one I'm waiting on. You're everything that I need. We got a spider. I think he's actually going to come out and fight us, though. Come on, buddy. Because he can crawl underneath stuff, but... Oh, you know what? It's daytime. He won't come after us. Well, gonna have to kill you. I'm sorry. Well, that was a waste. All right, here we go. We're going for whole room insulation. Whole room enclosure situation here. Just going to go ahead and see if we can get some monsters to spawn during the daylight hours. Because that's what we've got a lot of around here playing our little waiting game. Lots of daylight hours. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. If I just stand here and water dirt, will things eventually grow on it? Like, will that, will that do something? At any point ever? Oh, yay, more honeycomb. Woo. It's those back walls back there. That's where we're going to get some monsters spawning. Oh, yeah. Unless we can... Oh, do you think we could do this? Oh, look at that. Yes, perfect. That's the ideal monster spawning situation because we can still see in. And that's, that's good. That's what we want right there. Monster spawner done. Consider that one, like, completely successfully completed. Wasn't even a quest, but I did it. Melons might be nice to have. I don't think we're going to get anything out of this but by pl planting them over here, but I don't I don't see how that would hurt anything either. Who knows, maybe they'll really dig melons. Come on, bees, don't you like a good melon? Grow little melon, grow from the ground. I want to see you grown up proud. And when you produce a melon thick, I'm going to break it open with a pick. And when I've broken it open, I'm going to eat everything. 
That was a that was a stretch. That was that was poor. Poor form. My bad. Why doesn't this thing make noise? Why doesn't it make like a watering sound? I only say that because it's gotten real quiet around here. Oh, look at that. We're one away, folks. We are one away. Come on now. Melon stem? Give me a melon. Oh, we have a mini map. I just noticed on our mini map we got guys over here. Ooh. Oh boy. Lots of skeletons. Good deal. What's up, guys? Come on. Come and get me. That's it. Come on over here. Perfect. Cool. Alright, now of course the problem being that, uh, how am I supposed to get in there and get to this stuff? I have to kill them all, which means I have to aggro all of them. You know what we could do is put this here. And then break out this piece so they can see me, and then come and get me. Yeah, look at that! I am a cub and I'm brilliant! Cool! Alright, that was our first batch of monsters, the first real batch of monsters. Looks like we got some pretty good stuff out of them. We'll seal the door back up and make sure we pop. There we go. What have we gotten from that experience? Six bones, some brains, a bow, some arrows. Pretty good deal. Oh, look at that! Yes! Finally, goodness gracious, I've got both of them. I would like... More industrial apiaries, I guess, because I don't know anything about these. Just, just, just more of these. More of these. Claim my... Did I already claim it? What's happening? Claim reward. Selected. I selected the... Claim reward. Look. I've got all of these. Did it, did it work? It's not letting me claim the reward. Where are the industrial apiaries I'm supposed to be getting go? What's happening here? Completed. Unclaimed rewards. Give me the industrial apiaries. It won't give them to me. Why won't it give them to me? What have I done wrong? Is it because I've got too much stuff in my inventory? That doesn't make any sense. That can't be the case. Should I empty some stuff out? I'm going a little bit crazy here, folks. I don't understand. And I'm starting to get a little bit upset by it. Okay, look at this. We've got the honeycomb. Got the damp combs. Okay, thank goodness. What did I get, though? Where's my... Oh, right. Yeah, I guess we just didn't have enough. Because these don't stack. Proven frames. Production upgrades. I don't know what they do. Let's let's find out. Speed. To check if you are using the various bees that I gave you, give me some mundane and rocky combs. Then you can overpower your breeding with lifespan upgrades and more apiaries. So he wants us to make some mundane and some rocky. Well, we'll set those up. And then we will be on our way. We'll go ahead and collect these guys because they've done a fabulous job. Good work by all. Need to put them away in here. I've run out of space. We'll put all of our stuff in here. All of these things we'll put in here. Need to set up our new apiary. So we got two new ones. And we will set them up right here. Can they all be right, right next to each other? Or is that going to be a problem? I actually don't know. I guess we'll find out though. If it is a problem, comment down below. I'm really relying on a lot of user feedback here. Because every time I Google anything about bees... The answers are sparse. Apparently, people have not done enough with this pack. You'll need to you'll need to hop on that people who write wikis and things for free. I expect better out of you and your free content. Come on now. You're making it difficult for me to play video games. No, I'm just kidding. Seriously, though, if you folks want to help. Mundane and Rocky. Well, I've got some unusual meadows, water, mundane. Rocky for sure. I got a Rocky Queen. Forest Mystical, Unusual, Rocky, Forest, Meadows, Water, Meadows, Forest, Meadows, Meadows, Water. Folks, I don't know. How do you get a mundane comb? That's an odd one. That's a bit of an odd one out. Okay, well, let's go ahead and we'll get our Rocky Queen. We got her here. What happened to those, those things, those production upgrades? What do those guys do? What if I put those in here? Can put eight in there. Maximum installed, production plus 80%, energy consumption, or I'm sorry, 20%. Uh, energy consumption is also up by 20%, but apparently this is going to help us out a bit. We'll put the other eight in here, and then that leaves us eight more for, let's say, here. And what are we going to put in there? How do you get a mundane? Hmm, I'm, I don't, hmm. And what am I trying to get here? Eight of each? Okay, I'm going to Google it real fast. 
All right, according to the Google, an unusual queen is just what I needed. I needed this little bee. I'm going to go to sleep now. We'll pick this up. In fact, you know what, folks? I think we've done enough for this episode. I'm going to go ahead and go because I just looked up and realized how long I've been recording. I don't know how long this episode's going to be, but at this point, we're looking at one hour and exactly 20 minutes of recording to get where we are right now. So I'm going to take a nap here and when we come back next episode, I will go ahead and make one more during this session. I'm going to take a break and do one more. So I'll have two for the week. But uh, then we'll definitely come back with episode, is this six? So I guess we'll come back with episode seven and we'll have a lot of new user comments. So comments at that point. And until then, God bless you and I'll see you all later. Bye.